Today, we are going to compare the Kawasaki Ninja ZX4 RR and Ninja 400. When you look at these two bikes, you may not capture any difference between these two models as they have the same appearance. However, they are completely different bikes. Today, we are looking at these two bikes under four key factors and find out what are the differences related to these two models. When I consider the price of these two bikes, you can really see the difference between them. The Ninja 400 comes with a $5,499 price tag plus $400 for anti-lock braking system. On the other hand, the zx 4 rr costs $9,699, making it nearly $4,000 more expensive than the Ninja 400. That's a huge gap. You may be wondering where they put this extra money. Stay until the end and you will find out. Both bikes share the same 399cc engine, meet the Ninja 400, a marvel of engineering, featuring a parallel twin engine that unleashes 45 horsepower at its peak. It's designed for those who seek a refined blend of power and finesse. The zx 4 rr is equipped with an inline-4 engine that roars with a jaw-dropping 76 horsepower at its peak. Two bikes, one displacement, but worlds apart in character and capability. The choice is yours. Will you embrace the graceful finesse of the Ninja 400 or unleash the thunderous might of the zx 4 rr The journey ahead promises excitement, and it all begins with the engine that fuels your passion. Both bikes come with a trellis frame chassis, and in terms of the chassis itself, there are no differences. However, there is a slight variation in the wheelbase. The Ninja 400 features a lower wheelbase, which could potentially enhance the bike's handling capabilities. If we take into account the curb weight of these two bikes, the Ninja 400 weighs 21 kilograms less than the zx 4 rr This reduction in weight translates to easier handling for the Ninja 400. With a lighter bike, riders can experience improved maneuverability and responsiveness, making it more agile and enjoyable to ride, particularly in various riding conditions. Next, let's examine the differences in brake and suspension systems. While both bikes have similar rear suspensions, the front suspension sets them apart. The Ninja 400 is equipped with a telescopic fork, providing a decent level of performance. On the other hand, the zx 4 rr features a more advanced and higher-cost inverted fork. As a result, the zx 4 rr offers superior suspension capabilities compared to the Ninja 400, making it better suited for handling challenging terrains and offering enhanced riding comfort. zx 4 rr comes with dual disc brakes, while the Ninja 400 comes with a single disc brake. The dual disc braking system provides more braking power. However, the lighter weight of the Ninja 400 ensures that it has good and sufficient braking power with its single disc. Let's kick off our analysis by zooming in on the seat height of both bikes. As you can see, there's a noteworthy 16mm difference between the Ninja ZX4 RR and the Ninja 400. The Ninja 400 features a comfortable seat height of 784 mm, while the zx 4 rr comes in slightly taller at 800 mm. Now you might be wondering, does a 16 mm really make that much of a difference? The answer might surprise you. Yes, the 16 mm seat height difference between the two bikes can have a noticeable impact on the ergonomics, especially for certain riders. While it may not seem like a large gap, even a small variation in seat height can affect how a rider feels and interacts with the motorcycle. For riders with shorter inseams or those who prefer a more grounded position when stopping, the lower seat height of the Ninja 400 could offer greater confidence and ease of handling. On the other hand, taller riders may find the slightly higher seat of the zx 4 rr more accommodating, allowing for a more comfortable and natural leg position. So, what's the final verdict on seat height and its impact on ergonomics? Well, it ultimately depends on your individual preferences, body proportions, and riding style. If you value a nimble and approachable ride, the Ninja 400's lower seat height may be your ideal match. Meanwhile, if you crave high-performance thrills and track day adventures, the Ninja zx 4 rrs higher seat height could be the perfect fit. 
The ZX4RR handlebar emerges as the grand contender, boasting a wide and impressive design. Crafted from lightweight and robust aluminum, it epitomizes luxury and performance. Riders are treated to a regal riding position, thanks to its adjustable nature that allows for a personalized fit. During daring cornering maneuvers, the ZX4RR bestows a sense of confidence and stability, elevating the overall riding experience to new heights. However, the Ninja 400 handlebar, made of steel, refuses to be overshadowed. Resolute and reliable, it offers a more budget-friendly path without compromising on dependability. While lacking the adjustable feature of its adversary, the Ninja 400 handlebar remains a valiant choice for those seeking a solid performance without breaking the bank.